From the 2013 International CES in Las Vegas, this is another Into Tomorrow ITTV special report. How would you like to get your action shots with an interesting camera that will show you 360 degrees? Maybe you're just walking down the road, you're riding a bike, you're skiing, you're doing all kinds of fun things. Well, our next guests can make that happen for you. Uh, first of all, the customer care manager with a company called Geonaut is Sarah Bird. Sarah, welcome into tomorrow. Thank you, Dave. <laughs> Glad to have you with us. And you brought with you Philippe, is it Gardiner? How do you say your last name? Gardiner. Gardiner. Philippe Gardiner. There you go. A little bit of my old uh, French-Canadian-ism comes out of me uh, you know, three, <laughs> three generations ago. Uh, first of all, tell us about Geonaut. Uh, what is the company about? And then we'll get into the, the, the camera that you're showing here at CES. Okay. Uh, Geonaut is a French company. We're based in northern France. Ah, c'est bon. <laughs> Merci. <laughs> um, we're crazy about sports. We're all athletes. Very and uh, we're crazy about electronics and gadgets and everything that's going on here at CES. Well, you're in the right place for that, right? That's exactly. right. That's right. Is this your first CES? It, it is. It is. It oh. Is. That's right. We've been here as, uh, to see what's happening in yeah. a couple of years. And then you said, my gosh, we've got to we exhibit gotta there. there. We've got to be there. We've <laughs> yeah, got to exactly. show the world our camera. <laughs> there you go. And let's talk about the camera. This is the world's first 360-degree action video camera that uh, I'm going to, well, there you go. Chris is showing you on the video. It's on Philippe's helmet. As I almost said, it's on Philippe's head as if he's just <laughs> screwed it onto his skull. But it's on his helmet, and it gives you kind of an idea. There's uh, three cameras. Oh, look at that. He's even modeling it now. <laughs> Check it out. And there we have one on the desk as well. There's three cameras, so I'm spinning this around. Now, if you're listening on the radio, have no fear. We have the video for you at <laughs> intotomorrow.com. Just look for the Geonaut uh, interview with Sarah and Philippe, and you'll uh, be able to see the video. And we're showing you the camera itself right now. So describe it for our radio audience as we look at it on video. Uh, what does it do, and how does it work? Well, it's a 360-degree video camera. Um, it has three lenses with wide-angle optics. Um, all three lenses are capturing um, a video and they're all stitched together to make one big spherical image. There you go. So it's not like you're just getting three images. You're getting 360 degrees all the way around whatever it is you're doing. That's exactly, exactly right. 150 horizontal. Oh, okay. 150 degrees oh, up yeah. and down as well. Exactly. So you can see the, the ground, the floor, wherever you are, and the sky exactly. or the ceiling. Exactly. <laughs> and it, it takes basically video and sound and also does photos of 4K. Uh, with burst mode and time lapse. So, oh, even burst mode. Ooh. That's kind of fun, too, <laughs> if you're just out cruising or riding a bike or doing what, some mountain biking or something. <laughs> Can exactly. you give us an, an example? I see you have uh, an iPad here. Yeah, exactly. So clearly yeah. Uh, it'll connect to an iPad, and then as he's moving it around, just to warn Chris, he's probably going to also move, and, and there you'll see the activity moving. Now, you're using the iPad's accelerometer instead exactly. of, and, and as you move, the the image is moving and in this case this is right. actual video shot right with, you guys look like you're having a lot of fun there on the ski yeah. slopes exactly <laughs> and he's either moving it around with his finger or physically moving the, the ipad device. up and down and back side to side and uh and catching those 360 degree images how cool is that oh and right. look you made it to the summit on the mountain there <laughs> exactly <laughs> and they're, sh they're showing them having a good old time <laughs> yeah now is is this available yet no no, and it's not available yet. It's going to be available this summer. Okay, That's terrific. Right. This summer, just in time for more skiing. But yeah. water <laughs> skiing. See, we're from Miami, so we okay. think water right. skiing. It'll be yeah. late summer, though. They, yeah. Okay. Right. Yeah, it'll be more late summer. No problem. Do you have a price okay. uh, set yet about yeah, how much it's, it's going to cost? It's going to be around $399 in the pack. Okay. Exactly. Suggestion. Should be around $360 because it's a 360 camera. You're not Why the first don't? person to tell us ah, that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, all right. Yeah. But I'm the, probably the, your first interviewer on a national radio broadcast telling you that. Exactly. So, <laughs> so you, th you think about that, people can easily remember. Exactly. Um, but that's kind of cool because now you've uh, what are folks expected to use it for real quick what do you think that you most people are going to do well most most sports and then any activity we've tried to put in on a car in Paris uh, we've done many activities with it oh, so I you can be like your own little Google car put it on the roof and run it around, around town anyway yeah exactly so basically you can uh, you can find all this information on uh, geonaut360.com 
And you can also get all the latest updates on that by putting your information in, click on something, we get you the latest news and the pre-orders when we launch it before of the course. summer. Very good. And okay. pre-ordering is always a good idea. Now, is it available that you can upload videos that you shoot and can you then share it with people like on, on your Facebook page or how exactly. would you do that? We've got actually, we built a platform where you can upload your video, you can edit it online, create your path, put music on and then share it to all your social networks and then you can review it on your iPad, on your iPhone and we work on an Android app. app. Oh, good. Actually, yeah, get Andro um, us Androids want to have the same capability that the iPhoneies can do. So that's a good idea. And the fact that you're saying online you can edit it, add music, and make it even more fun keeps it interesting, huh? Exactly. Right. It's all simple and intuitive. That is what we want. Uh, and it's life in 360. The dynamite. Well, Philippe and Sarah, thank you very much. You have something very unique. And I thank, uh, thank our uh, Ed on our team for finding you on the show floor <laughs> and saying, hey, guys, check this out. Jeez, this is pretty so cool. <laughs> and he was absolutely right. It's different. It's unique. And it's going to be uh, available for folks by summer. Check it out at geonaut360.com. That's G-E-O-N-A-U-T-E. The letter, the numbers, 360.com. We'll get you there. Just come by intotomorrow.com, and you'll see the links for their video as well. Check it out here during the interview, as well as their website. Thanks for joining us. Thank you very much, Dave. Thank you, Dave. Continue good luck. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Bye-bye. I expect to see a lot of French countryside photos <laughs> and right. videos, right? <laughs> intotomorrow.com. For more, I'm Dave Graveline. We're back with more from CES in Las Vegas on Into Tomorrow here on the Advanced Media Network. <laughs>